There are three ways to get excited about dental hygiene again. The first step is to remember a time when you were really successful, when you felt like you were making a difference clinically, when you felt like you really connected with the patient and the dentist really appreciated you and things were just going well. Sean Anker, researcher, said if we can remember those thoughts and feelings, we're a lot more likely to repeat them. The second step is to be a contribution, to think outside yourself and to think about how you can make a difference. There was a time in my life I did not want to go to work. I literally said in my car, like a nut lady, Candy, be a contribution. This is not about you. This is about making a difference to the dental office. This is about helping a patient live a healthier, fuller life, about saving them money and time, about making a patient today feel like the most important person in the world. This is about helping your family get much needed money. Once I shifted it about me to other people, I was excited about hygiene. The third thing is to continually learn and grow. When you look at hygiene as an opportunity to learn and grow and stretch yourself, to learn more about products, to learn more how to communicate better, then it's exciting. It's not stagnant and boring because there's always opportunity for learning and growth. So I challenge you to remember a time you were successful, to think outside yourself and be a contribution, make a difference, and to continually learn and grow.